In this video, we're going to very quickly look at a couple of tips to clear space off of your hard drive if you're running out of space. So I am in Finder, and I've chosen the Macintosh hard drive right here, and you'll see that I have five primary folders on my hard drive. I'll also notice down here that I have about 95 gig available, so I really don't need to clear space off, but if you're running out of space, here's what you need to do. First of all, you'll notice that I have the size column here. This is going to help because this tells me what folders are taking up the most space, and then also what I'm able to do is sort by that folder. So I can see some applications and library and system folders here. I probably don't want to really mess around in those if I know what I, unless I really know what I'm doing. But if I go into the users folder here, I'm going to see my uh, different users, including my primary home user here, which is me and now if I sort by size I can see within this area all the different folders my music is taking up 35 gigabytes my movies are taking up just under 26 gig and so forth now how do I see that column I right click down here in the open area and I go under show view options and I make sure that the checkbox here is checked for size and I make sure that this checkbox here is checked for calculate all sizes. If for whatever reason it's not calculating sizes for you here, sometimes on certain Macs it just gets kind of hung up there, then you can go to any folder and you can right click on top of that folder and you can choose get info. And typically when you choose get info once, if it's clogged up a little bit, it's not calculating sizes, that will go ahead and unclog it and calculate the rest of the sizes, but you'll also see the size of the folder right here. So now I know where most of my space is being taken up. It's being taken up again in music, movies, desktop, uh, library, and screen flow temp. And then you'll see I've got about seven gigabytes of downloads here even that I might want to go in and clear off if I'm done with them. So then if I go inside of any folder, for example, the movies folder, and I sort again by size, which it's already done here, I can see the majority of that 25 or so gig of movies is actually iMovie events. So I could double click on top of iMovie events, again, sorted by size, and now I see those events that are taking up the majority of the space. So these two events, I know, for example, both of those are my two daughters, Lauren and Brooke. I'm really done with those two folders and those events. I've made the movies I wanted to make off of their baby movies. Uh, and I could take these events now and I can move them to an external hard drive. And that right there would very quickly free up about 11 gigabytes of space for me. Again, I don't really need to do that now. But that's how you go into Finder and kind of, uh, locate if you're running out of space where your big chunks of files are and then of course to delete something you just click on it and hit command delete that will send it down to the trash and then you need to go into the trash I won't have anything in here but then go and empty the trash to get it completely off your Mac and free up that space